Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the national anthem, which will be sung by the Stewart Creek High School Choir, directed by Dr. Brian Russell. As we gather here today, we are reminded of those in 2001, September the 11th, over 3,000 that lost their lives. It's good that we meet today, and not only here but in America, that we continue to meet to remember the lessons of 9-11, to remember and not forget that there are forces around the world that want to bring evil to our nation. And that's something you can't dismiss. The other thing is it brings to mind our resolve. And as a nation, something that we see in Americans at their best, it showed our core values. And that's something we celebrate. It showed duty, loyalty, selflessness, and it certainly showed love. And these are the things that we major upon. Defending ourselves, yes, and appreciating those that do it, but always standing for a country that is seeking freedom and peace for everyone.
Never forget what happened to your country and its citizens on 9-11. The images and videos are easy to find, but don't get hung up on the images. It's always easy to remember what is right in front of you, but never forget that which you can't see. The heart of the volunteers, the pride of the policemen, firemen, and emergency responders, the souls of those we lost, and the way of life that protected and served them all. That's what our flag stands for, as well as the uniform that you have on today. As a representative of Advanced Retirement Solutions and a resident of Rutherford County, Tennessee, I gladly present a flag to you today. I'm proud to serve next to you as citizens with all of you, and I'm especially grateful to all the men and women who served this great country, both here and away, be they military, police, fire, or emergency personnel, or those more like myself who support those that serve. I will never forget. Won't you do the same? Bring your unit to attention and present arms.